What's up everyone, this is Lord Nexus 193 here, back out with another video. Today's topic is... Memories. That's right everyone, memories. And, uh... In my previous video, I did talk about, of course, life. And I did mention memories. Memories... Is a... What we can uh, look back, uh, remember certain events and such and such. That's completely the definition of a mem memories. Um, in my older video, I talked about dreams. All right, the one that you don't know you you sleep. All right, so when you're sleeping, your brain aka a living computer we still don't know a lot about it we don't know how we have conscious and all that stuff but our brain store these memories and sometimes it gets rid of unwanted uh, memories while you're sleeping so that's what it kind of does as well besides just, you know, repairing your body and doing other things. Alright. Besides that, memories is split up in two different groups. The positive memories, those memories are, those positive memories are like getting married. Having, you know, your first child. Go on a family vacation, hanging out with friends, having fun, those type of memories. Then you got the negative memories, um, such as loved one passing away, a friend passing away, getting injured, getting a deadly disease uh, that you fondly remember. Even uh, in certain cases, if you're a veteran, you experience things on the battlefield, and once you retired from the military and stuff, you get PTSD in certain events. Uh, my grandfather on my mom's side had PTSD from uh, from World War II, so that that's uh, unfortunately happens to certain you know veterans um it's it's a terrible thing and much love to the veterans they need all the support they ha they need to get but um certain memories can trigger like say a firework if a veteran who has ptsd will once he hears or she hears uh the firework, it will trigger a memory and they will freak out and such and such. And uh, that's a sad thing. And people like that suffer through that. Even in, if, even someone who is not in the military and who witnessed some terrible things in their lives, they get PTSD as well. And, you know, it's, it's a tragic thing. And... And I hope these people, you know, I really do hope people get help. It's, it's not, PTSD is not a good mental illness at all. And then, besides that type of stuff, there's those who lose their memories. Uh, for example, diseases like Alzheimer's. Those type of diseases will destroy, basically, your memory, destroy other things such as your speech it's terrible it's sad and uh, it's it's a horrible disease to go to through but losing a memory is part of the negative part of, uh, of the whole idea or the whole process of memories it's I can say it's a difficult topic because I'm trying to explain to you guys what memories are and what the you know 
the functions it, it's if we we use our senses all right sight smell taste touch hearing we have these senses and we can identify things for example this penny here metal copper and uh another piece in another type of metal I can fill all right it's hard in some places it's, it's smooth but I can identify this as a uh, piece of metal all right and uh, it sends a thing to your brain and then the next time you look at something while you're holding something you remember what it is same with speech um, speech we learn speech and then we can remember and we can of course talk uh, it's our brains are amazing it is uh, it's a very interesting organ in our body and there's still a lot of things that we need to learn or study more about and hopefully unlock more secrets about our our brain and such um, even basically seeing you know I'm seeing you guys or actually I'm seeing the phone and I know this video is going to be put out there and if I haven't seen this video in a long time, once I find it, I will definitely remember what I was wearing, what I was uh, talking about, and all of that. It's memories is a very interesting topic, but it just there's just still not a lot of information besides looking back remembering certain events and uh, how it can you know our brain stores what we see touch smell and all that so but besides that everyone thank you guys for watching this video make sure to leave a like and if you're new subscribe and uh try to hold those good memories that's because those having good memories will help you uh, be more positive about yourself so don't worry about the negative memories um and for those who suffer with ptsd it's it's sad it is a terrible mental illness and and I do really hope people who have this mental illness get the help they needed and uh, it's a terrible thing and then other diseases you know diseases like Alzheimer's I hope they get you know people like that get the help as well but uh, that's it everyone make sure to leave a like Smash the subscription button or subscribe and uh, share. And this is Lauren Nexus signing out.